the bass keeps running, running, and 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 running, running. Hello all, this is going to show you how to correct the error that you're getting when you're trying to play Rainbow Six Vegas 2 on your PC. Uh, for those of you who have the game, you know that if you try to play with an Xbox 360 wireless controller, it will not enable initially, and there's a reason why. When the game installs, it has been designed to run with an Xbox 360 controller, if that is indeed what you want to do, but the corded one. That's how the configuration files are written when you install the game, so I'm going to show you how to change it, okay? First, you can go here to see Rainbow Six Vegas 2, okay, right here, phenomenal game. Um, I think all the Rainbow Six series has actually been great, but that one's one of the best ones in my opinion. Okay, so to fix the error that you're getting if you want to play with your wireless controller, this is guaranteed to work. Okay, go into your computer. Alright, here's your C drive, so go into your C drive. Alright, you want to go into your program files. Now, if you're running a 32-bit system, you're only going to have one folder that says program files. If you're running a 64-bit system, you're going to find program files x86, which means your 32-bit program files, alright? Then you want to go down and find your Ubisoft folder, because that is a company that created Rainbow Six. Okay, and Time Clancy's Rainbow Six Vegas 2, of course. Then you want to go in right here into this folder that says Keller Game, okay? Then you want to go into the config folder, alright? Then you want to go down and you want to find a file that says Keller Joysticks, alright? Keller PC Joysticks. I always, for some reason, lose this thing. But here it is, pckellerjoysticks.ini. Okay? When you double click it, it's going to open as a text file. Now, really quick, make sure that this line is under product ID and it says use X input true exactly like that. Capital U, lowercase s e, capital X i, lowercase n p u t, equal sign true. All right? Vendor ID needs to be changed to 1118118. Product ID 673. That's it. Leave it alone. No spaces, no nothing. Then you're going to see here it says joystick 1. You're going to see a few groups like this. You want to go all the way down to joystick 5 because if you only change that, what's going to happen is you'll be able to enable your wireless controller at that point, but it still won't work right. So what you want to do is make sure that all of this says exactly this. Product name equals Xbox 360 USB controller is already going to be there. Use X input true. You're going to need to insert that line just like you did. Okay. Vendor ID 1118. Product ID 673. Once you're done, you file. Save. Okay, because it opens as a text file, you'll be able to save it exactly like that, and I guarantee you, you will be able to play your copy of Rainbow Six Vegas 2 with your Xbox 360 PC wireless controller, okay? Make sure that you have saved that file and closed everything out, and that your controller is on before you run the game so that it can work properly, alright? This has been another Maverick um, another Maverick gaming presentation, rather. If you have any questions, please feel free to let me know.